<laughs> right, I've got my trial copy of uh, Home Designer Architectural 2023. And I'm going to go to, let's see. Yeah, CAD. Draw polyline. It's a closed polyline. And that's the kind of polyline that you can easily convert to a 3D object. So I'm going to click on it. And in the edit toolbar, there's nothing there. <laughs> OK. It's not like Chief Architect Premier. <laughs> OK, so I stand corrected. Let's see if I can find something here. Uh, here's something, maybe. Terrain wall, curb tool. That's what you used. Yeah, yeah. That's not what I'm recommending. <coughs> well, architectural is different from Premiere or Pro. So I'm going to have to fumble around here and find out how to create a custom slab. That's what I intended to do with this uh, video. I'm looking for it. Build, maybe be under the build menu. Stairs. Slab. Here we go. Okay. So you're under the bill men menu slab. Okay. And there's that closed polygon I was looking for. Now, how do you curve it? You click on a line and in the edit toolbar, there's a tool here for that. Change line to arc. Click on this one, change line to arc. It takes a little practice to get good with it. <clears throat> See, there's a triangular handle where you can uh, adjust the angle of um, curve. And then <clears throat> to further extend this, I'm going to use the break line tool. See, it's right here, the break line tool. You put a break in a line and create a new line. Left click, left click to create another line. And then I can take, click on this line and curve it. Click on this one and curve it. Like I say, it's not very automatic, but it is workable. So you can take this, open the dialog on it, there we go. And for the top, for the bottom thickness, see, you can make it uh, eight feet thick. See? That's what I'm talking about. Now, it takes a little patience for you to form, you know, form this thing. But uh, once you can see how it's done, you, the break to create a new line entity. And then you can left click and drag that. And then another break, another line entity created. Click on that, curve it. And this is very ugly, but it, this is the basic way you get it done in architectural, what I was suggesting anyway. And then uh, we'll go to a camera view. <clears throat> See, it's an eight foot tall concrete thing that I created myself and you can too, okay? So that's what I was talking about. Thank you. Hope this helps you. Bye.